Tagawa again, guys. Aren't we just lucky? Aren't we just lucky? All right, shore up the shore and divide and conquer. <laughs> Saxony Mechanical. Nordic Agricultural. Tier list says Saxony Mechanical. Tier B. Nordic Agricultural. Tier C. Tagawa Militant. Tier C. In theory, this is some... What of a balanced game. Um, I'm going to do something a little differently this time. What I'm going to do... So I'm just going to produce in place here. Go ahead and get that coin in list the second turn. Then I think I'm going to produce again. If I produce again, let's see what Saxony do. Saxony just produced, which makes sense with the mechanical board. Wait to see what Nordic does. So I produce, I trade for two food. I get the deploy in list, take some power. Then I produce again, go to two oil, trade for say an oil and a metal. I think this is gonna work out. I think this is gonna work out. Gonna get this right away before Sax starts to make any max. It's gonna take Sax a while to get out of his base with the mechanical board. So we do have some time to get to this encounter. But we're probably gonna see a trade for two oil here and an upgrade out of Sax, and he probably upgrade either the move or the bolster and the uh, deploy. If I, if I had to guess. Nope. No, he's going to rush the mech. Wait for the metal. So, uh, so Sa Nordic, I didn't notice this, but Nordic choosing to go for this village up here instead of the one on the left. This one's actually a little bit more vulnerable to Saxony than this one. So a little bit of an odd choice. All right. Now that we've got two oil on the ground, we can trade for one oil and say a metal. Hmm. Hmm. Axton, he's got the speed mac out now. No upgrades though. Because I want to get one, I, I want to try to get one upgrade with this board. I hate getting an upgrade with the militant board. You know the power is nice for Tagawa, and if you can get an upgrade on the move and the deploy, it's so much easier to get the max out. Let's go ahead and move. Let's hold off on that trap because now we can produce, get to three oil. Yeah, I like that. Produce and get to three oil. Then move again if we want. Or just go ahead and bolster into the upgrade and then maybe even trade for metal and move. Oh man. Oh, did they take the four metal? Oh, Saxony gets wolf off of that, wolf among the sheep, and they get four metal. That was, that was worst case scenario for us right there. Hmm. 
Hmm. We can't move. I think we just go ahead and we... Oh, we can't bolster. Get our upgrade. Still one oil short. We go for the enlist. Yeah, I'm sure he'll go underpass, and then he's going to have his eye on us. I don't want two games in a row where Saxony steals my encounter on Tagawa. I still can beat him to it, because he can't get there for two turns, and it's the same for me. I'm going to take the one worker. Does he have the produce upgrade? He does not, but he's probably going to get it. So at least he can produce on three of those spots, right? This is an odd worker distribution. And with workers on four different spots, surely you're going to get the produce upgrade here. No, popularity. Hmm. All right. I think we're going to produce and then move. Because we're going to see underpass out of Saxony this turn. No, now the upgrade. Oh. Huh. Okay. So I've got one more turn. Or I have to go to the encounter because the second mech isn't out yet. That means I can go ahead and bolster into my upgrade. Which is nice because I'll have a little bit more power when I hit this spot. This is all an experiment, guys. This is all an experiment. Yep. Saxony at six power and four cards. Really, really just hoping to get metal off of this encounter. Get a chance to deploy Ronin. Would have been nice to produce, upgrade, produce, or getting encounter, but it is what it is. Yeah, it is what it is. I'm just happy to have gotten the upgrade, to be honest. I'm kind of hoping that I can get uh, Get lucky here. Get some metal off of this. Okay, let's go here. Go here. And let's go here. I've become a fan lately of going slower to eight workers. Hmm. Not what I wanted. This would be great. But Sax is just going to take it from me. I basically have to do this. So let's pay for the recruit. I know it's going to be kind of expensive. And let's take combat cards. And which trap will hurt Saxony the most? Play cards. Would love some metal. 
Dax is going to wait. So I already have two enlisted out. Gotta think a little bit about this. I'm gonna do this because if Sax attacks me this turn, I can go ahead and trade for the metal, get my third enlist, and then he can't steal the metal, and I can come out, trap the tundra, and then deploy. Deploy uh, Ronin. This arm. I interrupt my. I move to the factory. The score looks like right now. Only have four coins on Tagawa Militant. That's pretty rough. Nordic going to bring out that first building. It's, I think it's time to take the uh, popularity. May find ourselves in tier two. Wood late to factory, maybe. It's not a bad idea. Any turns ahead are you typically thinking? Uh, I mean, at the beginning, if it's a combo I'm familiar with, I might know what I'm going to do the first eight, eight to ten turns um, because I've spent time planning it out previously. I'm on stream kind of winging it. I'm trying to think anywhere from three to five ahead, which is not a lot. But uh, trying to, it's a little harder to think a bunch of turns ahead when you're talking as well. <laughs> right, Nordic. I can't keep up with Nord what Nordic's doing, honestly. Um. I'm going to do what you were talking about. Hey, QB man, how's it going? Let's do Ronin. Let's guard our main production space. Okay, there's our coin. Now we're up to 11. That's the militant board for you. 11 coins over ag. Saxony mechanical. Saxony gonna get all four mechs before leaving the base. Yep, do Tom well. Yeah, now I can't move to there. You're right. Should have went ahead and got Sutan. That was a mistake because my move is over deploy, so basically I have to waste the move action. But at least this is the last enlist, right? So I can go ahead and move 
a bunch of these workers up to uh, up to this metal. I can start directly producing metal in between these moves. Saxony has not been aggressive so far. Biding his time. And maybe he wants to go for Nordic. Or power one card. Not have to step on a trap. Take a bunch of resources. I bet that's what he's doing. It's okay though, I have three more mechs, so. Hmm. Shore up the shore, divide and conquer. I think I can get divide and conquer here. I can be a little clever. Worker and three wood, build a structure, three food and a pop. Two food's pretty useless. Three foot. I mean, oh, he's going to actually make enlist the mechanical board. That's a little different. Already got two stars, though. Got Wolf Among the Sheep and got the Mech Star. Gonna go for the Enlist Star? Loving the content you've been putting out. Really allowed me to be competitive during my board game nights. That's great, man. Appreciate you watching. It's a, it's a fun game and it's fun to, I, I love, what, what is the old A-team phrase? I love it when a good plan comes together, something like that. Now we just need uh, Nordic to make some more buildings, right? All right, what are you gonna do, Saxony? My general plan right now, what I'm thinking is I'm gonna move these workers up to here, move one of them up to here, and then deploy probably Sutan on this tunnel. I think. Because what that will allow me to do is then produce um, here and here. And then I can move to here and here and get divide and conquer. But that requires Saxony to leave me alone on a tunnel. So I, maybe I won't deploy it here. I won't deploy it here. I'll just leave the worker there. And then the next time I move, since I'll have Sutan, I'll move the worker up here and I'll move the character up here and I'll, I'll deploy. Oh. Move time. We have five workers. And I can't move to the lake because I didn't take Sutan and I took Ronin. And make sure we take Sutan this time. Seventeen coins. Nordic sitting at eleven. Got one star. Pulled into a slight lead here. So how many workers are we going to take here? We've got to produce twice more. Five. What are you doing, Saxony? 
You have wood on the ground? No, just getting some spread. Good to see, though. It means they're not going to... Well, there's some moves left. What do you think? Three tunnels objective? Yeah, three tunnels. Wolf among the sheep and three tunnels, and we've got three star Saxony. We still got the edge, still winning. Need Nordic to build some of these buildings a little quicker. Saxony can end this game pretty soon, though. Um. Gonna produce two more times, so. Go ahead and put our two metal on the ground and put a two workers right here just to have them in a place that's a little bit better to spread out. So next turn, we move the character to the lake. We move the worker to the mountain. And we deploy maybe Toka or probably Toka or Shinobi right here, I think. Oh, there's a river walk mech out of uh out of Nordic. Alright, this is move number one. It's not gonna be a very useful trap, but I want it for the territory. That's what I need for divide and conquer. I need to leave these two here because that way the next produce will give me get me to eight workers. So I'm not going to use any more of the move. And let's get. Shinobi lets us defend the factory. I'm not, not sure how much that matters, though. Yeah, it's either Shinobi to defend the factory or Toka to get some spread into Crimea's base. Um, I'm going to go Toka because once I move to the factory, I can deploy Shinobi. Right here. We're here. Really no risk of getting attacked right here. And we got Divide and Conquer with Tagawa. Yes. 11 point lead right now. Significant coin advantage. Ugh. Oh. Factory may not be in our future. With Saxony at four stars and having a lead, we may be able to, depending on how this goes, we may be able to get combats by forcing Saxony to uh, end or to give us those combats because, let's see, we got enlist, gonna get worker, and mechs pretty soon. Nordic's going to build another building. Be nice if we could pick up a pop. How much coin would trading for a pop get us? Eight? Eight points? Seven because we'd have to spend a, a coin on a popularity? Nordic's just making these buildings so slowly. 
Which power does Nordic have? Only one combat. Guard still. Six pop. Oh, but we gotta spin the one to produce. Nothing for it though. At least we get a few points. Nordic just went into tier two. Hopefully Sax moves off the factory, that would be nice. He went here with the mech, all I can think that maybe he's guarding the encounter. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sacks just go to eight workers? No, he went to seven workers. Dead gummit, but he left the factory. Beautiful. All right, so we need to pick up some territory, right? Gonna get a Mac. We're gonna trap the factory. We're gonna get some coins. And Nordic's gonna help us out a little bit, bumping a sax worker there. And going down to six popularity. I guess they're not worried about getting tier two because they're gonna build more buildings. Good, hurry up with those buildings, Nordic. What's Sack just got? They've got their, their double move off of cooldown. And there it sticks pop. All right, definitely want to do this. Trap the factory. We don't need enlists, do we? This gives us pop. Yeah, I'm gonna take this, definitely. And... Sacks within striking distance. We get two combats. It'd be close. Go here, we could potentially attack Saxony with our regular move or a factory move. Boy, we got a nice lead now. Be nice if we could hit Saxony twice. Or if Saxony would attack us and let us feed them a combat. Spreading out. Oh, I'm not sure that was a good call for you, Sax. Right. Twenty eight points. I mean. Zach's gonna pay nine for this. No question, he's already got the power stars on four combat cards.
already got two objectives out though, so we don't see an end that turn. Now he's at five stars. And we've still got a lead. Oh, if we had our multiple move, we could end towards the end of the game this turn. So we could go into tier two. Or we could just take back the factory. Um... The way we'd go into tier two is we'd use the factory card to go one, two, and take this encounter, or one, two, and take that encounter. Um, take the safe play. I don't want to spend the four coin, the two coins. I don't need the upgrade at this point. So now I'm going to take this worker. Go to one, two. Take my power. Throw zero. Sax has to throw zero or the game's over. May settle for second here. Give us the win. Nope. <laughs> Not gonna, not gonna give us the factory back. Yes. All right, guys. Tagawa Militant, 18 rounds. Four stacks to give us the win there.